Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, this is Cody. I thought I'd uh, have to do a repair on a pre production sample I have here in my garage in southern New Jersey. So I thought this could be useful to show technicians how easy it is to switch out the motor and get to some key componentry inside the X3. Uh, you need two specific tools. You need a 5 millimeter uh, hex key Allen, um, and you also need a half inch uh, socket. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and start this, and uh, you get a chance to see how quickly it is to get into the uh, the motor. First thing I'm going to do is remove the fender. I've already loosened this one. Alright, so continuing here, we're going to use a ball head 5 millimeter. It really makes it fairly easy to back these last three motor mount 5 millimeter hex heads out. Okay. Alright, with the last hex head out, as you can see, the motor just simply drops right out. As you can see, I've got, I've got my X3 up on two 4x4 four four blocks just because this is my garage and that's the best I can do. So that's how you take the motor off. Okay, once I've got those back three motor mount bolts installed, I go ahead and slip my uh, two mount bolts through my fender hardware and uh, just line it up. Uh, one trick you should be aware of is that the, the longer screws should be in the four corners. Uh, the two short ones that mount your fender are just a little bit shorter. All right, once your fender's back on, it's nice and firm. You can go ahead and remount your drive wheel. Okay, last thing I want to show you is how to get to the power module. Uh, all your electrical connections are there, uh, your inhibits, obviously your motor mounts. Uh, so the power module is a really critical piece to be able to get access to. And on the X3, we tried to make that super accessible. This is how you get to the power module on the Rovi X3. Simply unthread these two thumb screws on the sides. Just like that. That's what they look like. Take off your rear door. Disconnect your battery. And then your power module slides out. Just like that. That concludes my tutorial on how to get to the motor and also how to uh, how to get your power module on the Rovi X3. Thanks for uh, joining me here in my garage.